So previously, I've shown you how you can turn a product photo like this into something that looks like this using only Gemini AI. But that is not the main point of this video. And if you are interested to learn more on how you can create a, this picture using Gemini, then you should ch be checking out my previous video. But for now, in this video, I'll show you how you can insert some text to the background of a picture. And essentially, we are trying to make the main subjects to be partially blocking the text in the background. And uh, this style is actually quite popular because you can add some context or extra information in the background. But but at the same time, that text is not blocking or not outshining the main subjects of the photo. So let me show you how you can generate or insert some text into the photo and what prompts that you can use with Gemini AI. So first, let's navigate to Gemini.google.com or you can also just use the mobile version of Gemini. It doesn't really matter actually. Now here, you can click this button the plus button and then click upload files and then you can select the picture that you want to modify in this case let me try using this picture of someone playing a guitar and this is one prompt that you can use and in fact this is actually the prompt that i use to create this picture so it's very simple just a solid color text in the background and this will work for most images that you will throw onto gemini so i do recommend to use that prompt but you can also use this variation that is optimized for a product photo especially for a product photo that look like this so this is one uh, example that i created with that prompt and maybe one benefit of using that prompt is that the style will be decided by AI. The texture, color, shadow, everything will be decided by AI. So AI will take a look at the picture and, and then choose the most appropriate style for the text in the background. And sometimes you can get something that looks wonderful like this one. But anyway, for most images, I do recommend to just start with the simple variation. And by the way, the prompt should be available in the description so you can copy them and then you can use it on Gemini. Now here, you can specify the color of the text. It could be white, black, orange, green, etc. You can change that. And then you can also change the text that you want to use. In this case, let me try using I love guitar. Maybe that's a text. I don't know. <laughs> but I think that should be enough. And then you can specify the position. It could be top center, uh, top left, and then maybe bottom left, or maybe center. It's really up to you. But in this case, I'm going to be using the top center profile. And once you're done, click tools, click create images, and just uh, submit the request and wait for Gemini to actually modify the picture. And usually it will only take about maybe 20 seconds, uh, usually less than that to create the picture. So you can see the picture in about now. Okay, so sometimes you can get a mixed result like this. So the text is actually or partially in the background but uh, this person is also in the background so it's also a style that i would say valid some people do use that some people just make part of the text block and some other part of the text is actually in the foreground so you can get something that look like this but if you're not quite happy and you want to put the text to be exactly in the background then you can also go back and then redo the process and honestly i have done so, so many iterations and stuff like this can happen no matter what prompt that i'm using so if that happened just click the redo button and hopefully on the next iteration you can actually put the text to be exactly in the background so we got this result and as you can see the text is definitely in the background now let me do one more demonstration but i'm going to be using the product photo variation so i'm going to open gemini again and let's start a new chat i'm going to click this click upload files and select maybe uh, let's try this picture a pair of shoe and i'm going to copy the prompt let's go back to gemini and i'm going to replace the text to be unleash your speed click tools click create images and send the message and by the way if you let's say got the result and you want to do more modification you can always describe the editing again to gemini so you can do some iterative work to get the kind of picture that you want to get all right so uh, okay we get something that looks kind of 3d i would say but it is definitely something that was uh decided by ai so ai 
uh, look at the picture and then decide well this is the style that is appropriate for uh, this product so we got this result and definitely it's a bit more unique than the simple solid color text so that's basically how you can put the text into the background using gemini ai thank you so much for watching and i'll see you on my next video